I normally start these videos um, with a quirky title or a catchphrase or something, but um, today is not one of those videos. Uh, so basically, um, I'm pretty sure you know by now, but if not, let me just refresh you on what's happening. And as you can tell from the title, this is about NVIDIA. So, as you probably know, if not, I was doing a video about this anyway, but uh, NVIDIA released their new 3080 cards, which has RTX ray tracing and all that. It's basically, it is pretty much the shit at the moment where you should. It is, it is a must have if you're into NVIDIA gaming or if you're into gaming, this is something you should really have. So that is what was going on. So as per usual, they always send out review units to different YouTubers, media outlets, just as a review unit. So uh, what happens is they get it, they test it out. And usually what people want to do is give their honest reviews. There are companies where they say, you have to give us a positive review if we send out our products and those aren't usually the big name brands they're usually one of the more smaller brands that you wouldn't expect or you wouldn't probably even like normally hence they have to take that step but that is not something which is expected of nvidia and that is natural however though they did send a review to many people i'm sure you've seen linus's tech uh linus's take on it uh, he's done countless videos already with those cards on it, as well as his take on what this video was about. Um, you've seen Austin do a video on this. Even one of my favorite YouTubers, Jonathan Marson, uh, he did. He actually gave one away a few days ago. So there's tons of videos out there promoting what, how good a graphics card that is, but. That is not what this is about. As good as it is, it can very well have some limitations. Some there are there might be some things which is which it currently does not possess. And the whole reason behind this is technology. Technology is it's always evolving, so it's not always out there. Either way, I am kind of digressing from my real point, which is that. Yes, they did send out few review units, uh, well, f quite a few review units actually to many different YouTubers and everyone gave their honest review, honest opinion, and they're mostly positive as they should be because it is a, it was a good, it is quite a good graphics card from what I see and what I hear. There's a channel called Hardware Unboxed. I'm pretty sure you know that that is, that is a way bigger channel than mine. I mean, mine's literally one of the smallest channels you can think of, but uh, I just needed to get this out because, uh, because of the whole thing that's going on. And I just really needed, I felt like I needed to weigh in my opinion and up. I needed to put in what I felt like. So he gave his honest review. He did highlight all the good parts, but he also highlighted a few limitations that he felt. And the moment he did that, he did actually get an email from NVIDIA where he was told that from there onwards, because of the editorial direction that he, he has taken with the review of the review unit that he got, which was in initially supposed to be an honest review in the first place, uh, they're kind of uh, essentially told them that they will have a ban on review units till they change their narrative. And what that pretty much means is that if, or here onwards, if they don't provide something along the lines of what NVIDIA wants them to do, they will not send them review units. Now, my problem with this is I, you can have a business model, you can have anything, but you, if, you send, if you send review units, and I mean review units, and not something that is, um, something that is set, said to be a shell or anything that is like, I'm sending you this only so that you can give me positive reviews, 
and that is something they will mention, they should mention. Otherwise, you're in for an honest review, be it negative, be it positive. So they sent it to them and then they banned, it, banned that channel from getting review units and pretty much said, unless you change your narrative, we will not be pro providing you uh, with review units. And he, I mean, they added a lot of corporate jargon, as we all know, which exists in this nonsense corporate world where they wanted to say, oh, this is the app. We want to highlight how our gamers use these cards for all, all the nonsense bullshit, which does not really make any sense. Uh, I mean, it doesn't make any proper sense relative to what's actually happened. And all that, I was actually planning to make a video uh, kind of fuming about the fact that NVIDIA, being one of, one of the bigger brands, did that. And, I mean, like I said, Hardware Unbox is a way, way bigger channel. And for me to go up to this and say something about NVIDIA like this, I'm pretty much foregoing any chance that I will ever have of ever receiving a review unit or any form of interaction from NVIDIA, no matter what. I'm potentially, I'll potentially be losing exceptional amounts of sponsorship chances, opportunities, but you know what? I, it's just, we are, believe it or not, we are a very close-knit community when it comes to the tech, YouTube tech community. And if you go against one of us, essentially, it feels like you're attacking all of us. And it pretty much meant I felt like I felt attacked when they did that to Hardware Unboxed. So I honestly didn't know what to say. I don't usually do scripts and stuff, but I do have bullet points. I don't even have bullet points for me, as you can see. My hands are just moving. I don't have anything to say about this. I, I'm just going candid because I was in the middle of shooting another video. Um, I, I, I am quite, I'm quite pissed off at this point at NVIDIA. And honestly, if that is how you plan on doing your business, NVIDIA, I'm not a big channel in any way, shape or form. But potentially when, when I do reach a million subscribers, I still don't, I'm pretty sure you'll never send me anything anyways. So here goes. You are absolutely, I mean, you're a fucking disgrace for doing what you did. And I don't think this should be the way. Also, I just want to say that Hardware Unbox is a brilliant, brilliant channel and a very honest channel at that. Because they did post something saying that they had a ban on us and they were basically after getting all this all that all this backlash and everything uh nvidia kind of walked back on what they no, uh, basically they walked back on the ban on hardware unbox but here's the thing though and nvidia i i know you're not watching this but i sincerely hope you do because keep this in mind Walking back or taking back something you said is not an apology. And when you're apologizing, it sure as hell is not sincere. So while you've taken it back, you've taken whatever you said, you've taken off the ban, you've done it because of the backlash. You've done it because big names like Linus, J. Susens, and way more bigger, bigger channels all kind of came and literally gave you help. They had Hardware Unbox uh, back, and that is because of how amazing this whole tech community is. And because of that backlash is why you took everything out. So NVIDIA, just know that is not how a big channel, how a big company, how a big company like yours, that is not how you do business. And if you do, you know very well that is something you should be pointing out very, very soon. And before any contractual ag agreement, you put that up saying you have to provide positive reviews. If you're looking for honest reviews, if you're looking for reviews and not bought or sold out uh, reviews, sold out opinions, 
then hope for the positive, expect the negative. That is all you can do. And worst thing of it all is, by the way, you're still using <laughs> unbox, hardware unbox testimonial on your freaking website for DLSS. What is that about? He's not, his channel's not good enough to receive your review units because he gave an honest opinion. But when it comes to your advantage, you've taken his testimonial. So seriously, NVIDIA, get your shit together. No fucking fanboy will come and defend you. And anyone who's defending you for this, they really, I don't know what else to tell them. If you're against what I'm saying, you will probably ignore this video anyway. But if you're against what I'm saying, please unsubscribe from my channel. I do not mind. I'm a very small channel. I have very, very, very limited resources. But at least I have a spine and I still have my integrity. So NVIDIA, I know you'll never, you'll never watch this, but if you ever take the time to actually look at how many people had a hardware unboxed back, then you'll understand what a community actually is. And maybe you will fix your ways. Till then, you know what? F yourself.